And the other issue you have is even if you have a good backup, I mean, you, when you go into this, you have to realize that um, the market is slow and you aren't guaranteed any price here. Like you don't know when, it, when somebody says, what am I going to get for my house? Well, I don't know. I'll give you a range. It's so hard in this market right now. And the way the market conditions are, people just are approved for a lot less money, right? Like they are. For and, sure. you know, they are all scared. Like right now, in, in all my years of doing this, I've never seen buyers who are being so fickle. Like they'll put an offer in and then they walk away. They put an offer, gets accepted. They give no deposit. It's like they're all afraid to make a mistake and pay too much. Well, I think there's stability. And I think that also comes from that agent communicating to them and educating them possibly. Like I'm seeing that too a little bit, but I haven't seen that recently. I've seen that more in the spring, but there's a lot more product. So is it safe to say, oh my God, we just I know we put an offer on this property, but look what just came up. That's in our range. We need to go after that. Or maybe it's cheaper. I don't know. But there could be different motives for that as well. I, I'm not seeing that so, so much right now. And I think that has to do with the amount of inventory currently on the market. What I noticed in the market, we're going to drift off here for a second, but we think about we're, we're the first week of November heading, well, sorry, second week of November in a sense, weather started to shift a little bit. You know, we've had some great weather the last couple of weeks and, you know, and I think that took a lot of these buyers going to go play a bit more and enjoy that weather for sure. But it will be interesting to see if they, if things are going to pick up, but I believe that seller who's maybe listed right now, or maybe even listed for 35 days right now, has a three to four week window to sell their property. And if they don't, they're going to move into the next year. And I've noticed that in the condo area is they've dropped compared to where they were 35, 40 days ago, because that seller's going, holy cow, where did they go? No showings, single digit showings. We need to reduce to entice them now. I wonder if that will be enough to get them back in.